What's a block withholding attack? Block withholding attacks are not an issue if you're solo mining. If you are mining for yourself, you're not involved with any other people. And the reason is, if you go find a block, you know, if you're if you're hash power, if you're S19 sitting in your garage, finds a block. I have an S19 in a bear in my garage. Yeah. So if your S19 in your garage finds a block, if you're the one who will get the reward for that block, obviously your incentive is publish that block. Publish the block, other people start building on it, you earn a lot of money. In the case of a pool, it means you and I and a thousand other people get together and rather than you mining a block that would pay you, in something like say the ocean model, you mine a block that would go pay all of us. Or even just you would mine a block, like so let's say I'm running the pool, you would mine a block that pays me directly, and then I promise I'll then pay you back. But what if you want to make my pool fill? Yeah, what if uh, I'm yeah, what if I'm a competitor? Yep. Or let's just say I am just selfish in general. Yeah. You're you're an asshole. Yeah. True. You can point at hash okay. power at my pool, and then when you find a block, you just don't tell me. And there's not much I can do to prevent that. Because the pool, to the pool software, it looks like I'm just submitting uh, shares occasionally. Yeah. And I happen to not find yeah. a block. Yeah. A problem with block withholding attacks is we don't, it's hard for us to know if they're happening.